We're on camera, Tom. These aren't stills. It's two things. It's one, you're flattered to be considered as one of their peers, and two, it's nerve, a little nerve-wracking because then it's, what am I going to talk about? Am I going to be funny? Am I going to be smart? Before we would tape the show, I would sit down with a couple, one or two writers, and go, let's see if there are any second takes to do that kind of stuff. But we still, I still thought of them. Yeah. I learned a little bit about myself. I'm not as smart as them. <laughs> but I knew that, I kind of knew that going in. Yeah. I'm, I, I'm, I'm a different, I'm a simple, I'm a simple smart. Yeah. There's, a, there's many levels of not being dumb. I was going to say genius, but I'm, I'm just going to go, there's many levels of not being dumb. And I'm almost one of those. I knew Shanling was kind of, kind of zen deep like that. The kid I didn't, I've never met before, so that was cool, yeah. Uh, Judd and Mark, I both, I knew, I knew them all. A guy on my new show, on Men of a Certain Age, he plays my bookie. His name is John Manfalotti. We started out in the comedy cellar. He was before me, but this goes back 20 years. I hang out with him all the time. He's my hiking buddy, my Pilates buddy. Yeah, we do Pilates. Pilates.